We travel not to escape life, but to have life not escape us. But seriously, I'm going to throw that cheesy quote out the window, but it's definitely very, very true. I always wanted to travel to London, and I just graduated a few weeks ago, so I thought this would have been the perfect time to travel to one of the greatest cities in the world. London! Hey guys, so today I am going to Camden. I just wanted to vlog really, really fast because I'm about to leave to catch the bus to go back to the airport to catch a train and to catch another train to go to Camden. And Camden is fun. It's kind of like, if I can mention a neighborhood in New York, I would say like 14th Street, Union Square, the village, Soho type of thing. So yeah, I'm excited about that because they have a lot of flea markets and stuff like that. Um, I'm also going to go back to Oxford Circus. The shopping there, I am trying to control myself. But I bought like these cute high-waisted jeans. And they had the perfect fit. And um, what else did I buy? I went to Primark. Primark. Old cheap, but it's of quality. So they have a whole bunch of stuff in there. So I'm going to go back there. So yeah, I'll be taking you guys with me. And before we do that, I wanted to show you guys my outfit. To your heart without breaking your skin No one has the power to hurt you like your king Kept it inside, didn't tell no one else Didn't even wanna admit it to yourself And now your chest burns and your back So I'm in Camden right now it looks like so hot in New York. It's crazy. Self to blame if you continue to live this way. All this shit together, you wanna heal your body. It's so weird because it feels like New York, but it's not. Freaking crazy. Whatsoever. But I'm having fun. So you will be. Yeah, so in Camden, it was a lot of cool vintage items and shoes and jewelry and things like that, and I really loved it. I also ate at two really good places. I had fish and I had uh, mozzarella sticks, like stuff that's small, and I also had a glass of Merlot, and that's my favorite other red wine. The other one being Sangria, I didn't have any yet. And then after that, they had these like quartz and crystals and stuff like that, and it had a spiritual meaning to it. So I definitely want to go back to Camden and love it there. Cause the words that come from your mouth, you're the first to hear. Speak words of beauty, and you will be there. No matter what anybody says, what matters most is what you. Think of yourself, get it together, you wanna heal your body, get it together, you have to heal your heart, whatsoever you sow you will reap, get it together, the choice is yours, no matter what it is, to choose a life. It's the choose to forgive. Then after Camden, I went to Oxford Circus, and all I did, I swear, all day was go in and out of the rooms. And you can't help it because this is stuff that is not seen in America. They come out with the clothes that is like the perfect color. Usually in New York, things are hard to find in certain colors here. Whatever color you want, trust me, they have something in it. A jacket, short, skirt. So I've been doing a lot of shopping and things like that. No one has the power to hurt you like your friends. 
thought it would never change But as time moved on That ugly duckling grew up to be a swan And now your chest burns and your back aches Because now the years are showing up on your face But you never be happy and you never be all until circuits and I'm in love with this place um, if you didn't know already I travel by myself a lot of people are like oh my god you're out here by yourself are you crazy but I took this trip because I always wanted to go to London so now I'm here and I just feel like that's another advice for you guys like if you want to go someplace go if you want to do something do it because you shouldn't have to depend on other people to go with you to experience certain things or you know it's just something I'm learning as I grow older like you can do things by yourself you don't need people all the time to be there but um, I definitely love it here and I've been eating out a lot, I've been shopping too much and um, yeah just exploring London. I'm actually considering moving here when I grow older, probably around 35 so we'll see. But it's so funny because a lot of people here while I'm traveling they're like, are you from America? And I'm like, yeah, they're like, that is so cool. That's so cool. And I'm like, can we switch, please? It's so funny. And then I'll say, I'm like, oh, from New York. Really, America is like a movie. I love America. And I'm just like, whoa. Not to me. Maybe because I've been there for a long time. I mean, I think it's the greatest state within America. But I really would like something different, new environment, and things like that. But yeah, I'm having a great time. The next free vlog will be like a talk-through video. It won't be, I mean, it won't be a talk-through video. It will be something like, um, you know, me actually vlogging live. I plan to do that, but it's kind of hard. Um, this is my third day, so I'm still getting into the groove of things and stuff like that. So, yeah. And I'll see you guys in the next one. And all the items that I'm buying, I will be doing an upcoming haul. There are some great, beautiful items I have. So, get excited. I'll see you guys later.